in our best ever season of treble, 36 points in a row. When, when, when have you ever seen that happen before? You talk about budget, you had to go and reproduce uh, players. Keane left, we go and get someone in there. We won a title with Tom Cleverley and Paul Scott. You think Guardiola can do that? You think Guardiola can go in a team that is struggling and redefine it and make it his team? Everything that Guardiola's had is money. That's, let's be honest, yes, it's talent. Yes, it's his team. But if you look at it, Fergie struggled and he, and, he, and he was a magician at doing it. He got young players like Wayne Rooney, Cristiano Ronaldo, and he had to make them who they are today. Well, to start off with 100 points is probably one of the hardest achievements to actually achieve in football. Um, the style of football we played in that season, where we pretty much dominated English football with obviously winning the whole sweep, FA Cup, Carabao Cup, Premier League. We got to the quarter-final of the Champions League, failed. 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 The hardest thing to do is win the Champions League. And who won that? The treble. Alex Ferguson. Twice. It is, the treble is it? twice or the treble? No, no, no. We won the Champions League. Yeah. Twice. The treble. No one's done it before. You're still doing it now. You're still but trying no to do it now. The quadru- You're the- still trying to do it now. No 100 points won. is okay, but we're concentrating on different things. And that's what Alex Ferguson did. He reproduced teams. But done it on budget. Bread and butter, the done it on budget. Their bread and butter. Done it on a budget. So budget, you're talking about a budget, I don't think that's correct at all because we United spent million were, players. were the best team in the night with the nineties and then in two thousand you still bought big money players, but now we've come into it now it's all oh city are buying this. So but you bought the league one year, Ferdinand thirty million and you got um, Alan Smith from Leeds as well. All these players, big money at the time. Now football's got inflated with the millions of pounds. So if you think about 50 million now and 20 million back in the day, exactly the same. Tactically, at his age, 70 odd, still competing. I'm looking at Guardiola thinking, not, not that age, I'm sorry. I think by then he's kind of like, he's, he's always talked about it now, he says, I'm bored of football already. How can you be like, I'm bored of football already? Ferguson couldn't do it in any other league. So I think... Scottish League. Scottish League. Against Real Madrid, Champions League. So Pep Guardiola, what won the Champions League with Barca, dominated Spanish football, went to Bayern Munich, dominated German football, now he's come to England and dominating football. Bearing in mind, you got Xavi at Barcelona, you got your own manager Ten Hag, and you got Arteta, who's been nurtured by Pep Guardiola. Pep Guardiola has given the knowledge to them to make them teams go top. What did Ferguson do? Who, who, who's he taught? Who, who's, Who's he give his knowledge to, or was he just a good man management? Not and, tech, I, and I could argue that Guardiola got it from Jurgen Cruyff. Johan Cruyff, sorry. How do you know? Well, who is it? Is it La Masia is built on, built on Johan Cruyff. How do you know? Four KDB. Oh, oh, oh. This is going to get tasty. I know there's a couple of soft rivalries in, in London. But name them, name them. Listen, Arsenal, man. Soft Arsenal, you know, you know what I'm saying? Arsenal, Tottenham, this is the rivalry, mate. Watch this now, he won't do nothing with this shot. Come on, fix his skulls. Don't rush it. Remember, you need two to win. 